heart skipped a beat and you knocked me off my feet the first time that I kissed you. I knew my life would change. This is the new version of the Batman Water Boy. Um, it's got a soft sail. Um, and we've got the connection points for the towing bridle and the net at this pole here. This uh, removes the problem with the existing corn trawling otter boards where you are forced to tow them on the seabed at a very high angle of attack, around 40 degrees. Um, this maintains sufficient stability in the otter board while they shoot away. By moving the connection points to the same location at this pole means the angle of attack you've got on the seabed is the same as what you've got on uh, while you're shooting away. So the 20 degrees which is sufficient for shooting away is maintained uh, while the, this that wing on a board is on the seabed. The 20 degrees operation on the seabed means that the other board can operate much more efficiently than traditional other boards. In order to um, help with shooting away, I've moved the, the heavy shoe um, into the direction of tow like this. And this makes the other board a lot um, more friendly to the seabed. There's no scraping of the, um, the contact shoe on the seabed. It slides in the, in the, in the fore-aft direction or in the direction of tow like a sled. And the bottom of the foil has got a flap, a rubber flap. So what happens here is the high pressure on the front side of the uh, foil forces water to flow underneath the otter board. So the foil is actually floating on a cushion of high pressure water. Um, it supports the foil um, underneath the um, rubber flap on the bottom of the foil. made from a conveyor belt. Um, it's the same material that we use on the chafing mats underneath the um, cut ends. This will be robust and, and resist um, all the normal activities of trawling. The advantage of going to um, a flexible sail like this is that we can reduce the weight of the foil. It helps with the orientation of the board while it shoots away. The other big advantage is that producing these foils, which have got the optimum shape that we want, can be done with a lot cheaply. Very cheap, the sails um, probably, spare sails probably cost less than $200. Whereas um, if we built um, solid foils, um, you know, you'd be talking about a manufacturing cost of a couple thousand dollars. First time that I kissed you You changed a lonely me into my favorite place to be Since the first time that I kissed you Our time has come To make the board just as effective at providing lift at 20 degrees angle of attack to go to a higher aspect ratio sail 
higher aspect ratio foil, in this case is a sail, um, means that it produces maximum lift at 20 degrees. So these boards at 20 degrees angle of attack provide the same lift or spread to your gear as existing boards at 35 to 40 degrees, but with one third, or with 70% less drag. So the drag is phenomenally reduced um, when you operate these other boards, high aspect other boards, at um, 20 degrees angle of attack or a lower angle of attack. Change and I'd be glad to rearrange the first time that I kissed.